Oyster Return Day. Okay. It's becoming a rite of early summer on the Chesapeake Bay. Where? About a thousand participants in the Chesapeake Bay Foundation's Oyster Gardening Program grow young oysters each year in rivers and waterfront areas and then transport the adult oysters to several collection points around the bay. Return Day. On a first come basis each June, oyster gardeners are also invited on the CBF workboat Marguerite to help plant the mature oysters on sanctuary reefs off limits to harvest. Some feel a little anxiety as the moment draws close to part with oysters they have nurtured from larvae stage in small cages for 10 months. But then the fun starts. <laughs> so yeah, whenever you're ready, uh, just be careful and have fun and don't let any plastic in the bay and right on over. <laughs> <laughs> trying to swim with the oysters. Oysters are a key to improving the bay's water quality. One oyster can filter up to 50 gallons of water a day. The oyster gardening program makes an important contribution to the bay's cleanup, with participants collectively planting half a million oysters a year. The trip back to the dock is a time for tidying up, learning about some of the wonders of the bay, and finally, for telling stories. Well, I was really into saving the bay, and so we went to the Chesapeake Foundation, and we got this class on how to make the cages, and we made them and got our baby spats, and we um, hung them off the dock. Um, I like dumping it. It was kind of hard, though, because they were really heavy, but it was fun. <laughs>